Speaker 1. Jess and I go back a long way. She's a childhood friend I've known since nursery school. We don't see a lot of each other these days because her family moved away, but we've always kept in touch on Facebook. Until now, that is. I've been wondering why I hadn't heard from her for a while when I discovered she'd unfriended me. I sent her too many games requests, apparently. I know we've had our ups and downs over the years, but I had never envisaged us drifting apart. I feel really let down. Speaker 2 Ollie and I have been classmates since the first day of secondary school. We hit it off immediately. In fact, we were inseparable until last year, when Ollie started going out with Mia. Inevitably, we stopped spending so much time together. I was fairly confident that we'd be able to keep our friendship going, so I never expected him to unfriend me on Facebook. The reason he gave when I confronted him was that I posted too much. I couldn't believe it. I thought I knew Ollie inside out, but it appears I was wrong. Speaker 3 The first time my friend Rosie introduced me to Charlotte, we got on like a house on fire. It was great to find someone who was on the same wavelength as me, and we bonded straight away over our ambition to become engineers. The three of us started meeting up regularly, and I friended her on Facebook. That was six months ago and I've just found out that Charlotte has unfriended me. Rosie said something about me wrecking our friendship by tagging Charlotte in unflattering photos, but I've hardly posted any photos recently. I really don't understand what's going on. Speaker 4 If mine and Jamie's parents hadn't been friends, I'd probably never have struck up a friendship with him. Jamie and I are like chalk and cheese. When we were younger, it didn't seem to matter, but as we've grown up, our differences have become more apparent and we hardly see eye to eye on anything anymore. We were friends on Facebook until recently, but then he unfriended me with the excuse that my posts are too political for him. I'm not that bothered about falling out with Jamie, but I'm afraid that some of my other friends might think the same. Speaker 5 I got acquainted with Gemma on the first day of basketball practice and until now we've stuck together through thick and thin. Win or lose a match, we've always been the best of friends. But when I told her the first team were looking for a new player, she dropped me, just like that. Only last week I found out that Gemma had unfriended me. She told a mutual friend of ours that I was training harder just so I could get the first team place and tell everyone about it on Facebook. I'm really hurt that Gemma is treating me like this. I know she's desperate to play for the first team, but I don't think that's any reason to talk about me behind my back. Speaker 6 